you doing? This video on the police department. Your name? Moore. Good citizen. Okay. We do for a living. Couldn't tell you all that. Okay. What do you do for a living? You see it? I don't see nothing. What do, you, what do I see? Welcome back to the Audit the Law channel. On here we break down police interactions and go over audits that test the freedom of press in public. Today's video comes from the channel Jeremy Thomas. In this video, Jeremy is at the Cecil City Hall, which is also connected to the Cecil Police Department, located in Cecil, Georgia. This video involves Officer Moore and Deputy Nava of the Cook County Sheriff's Office. Jeremy is not an avid cop watcher or auditor, but he decided to try his hand at it in this video. Cecil is a relatively small city, and it probably doesn't get much transparency or accountability. The video starts out with Jeremy just simply exercising his First Amendment right to record in public. And he doesn't even go inside the building. But that doesn't stop those from inside alerting the police. Instead of me telling you about it though, let's watch the video and see how it plays out. Hey you guys, it's Jeremy Thomas. Subscribe to my channel please. I'm in Cecil, Georgia. Cecil, Georgia, doing an audit. They don't have many cars, they don't have nothing but maybe one car out here, but it's nice. Like I said, I'm in Cecil, Georgia. Jeremy Thomas. Everyone tells me to hold my camera this way. Do they have these big ass police cars? Excuse my language. No trespassing, keep out. Well, it was peaceful and quiet. How you doing? Good. Just video on the police department. Sir. Video on the police department. Can you take the purpose? Nah, just just because I can't do it. Can't do it. Okay. Yeah. You live in Cecil? Sir? You live in Cecil? Nah, I live in Bad Austin. Austin. Your name? Moore. Good citizen. Okay. Uh -huh. People calling about you. I guess they're concerned about what, whatever you're out here doing. Just video. Walk from Austin, Cecil? Do I walk? Yeah. No. I drive. Okay. Down there by Stuxel, I'm assuming? Yeah. Okay. The purpose of First Amendment audits is to provide transparency and accountability and to freely exercise your right to freedom of press. It can be from inside or outside a government established building. With that being said, after watching for a bit, there are a few things I want to point out. Jeremy let Officer Moore know that he's not from Cecil and actually told him what city he is from. Remember, as an American, you have a Fifth Amendment right to not answer questions. Now, Jeremy didn't completely fumble this because he didn't give his name, so I'll give him props for that. Now, he didn't even go inside, so I'm not sure why the police were called in the first place. I must say though, for it being one of his first audits, He's pretty calm with the presence of Officer Moore. Any interaction with the cop can always go from 0 to 100 very quickly. So it's always important to stay calm, cool, and collected, just like Jeremy is doing here. But let's keep watching and see how this ends. Is there a particular reason why you're coming to the police department? Just because I can do it. Well, I know you can do it. I mean, there's no reason behind it. I know better for you to do today on a Thursday. No. No? Nope. Work? Yeah, I work, I work like you work. Okay. Yeah. What do you do for a living? Couldn't tell you all that. Okay. What do you do for a living? You see it? I don't see nothing. What do, you, what do I see? Uh, I guess it's Halloween. I don't know. Or April Fool's Day. It could be. Could yeah. Be. Can I help you with anything else? Sure. 
Can I help you with anything? Sir? Sir? Because you want to be here or you need to be here? I want to be here. You want to be here? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, we both can videotape together. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. Okay. It's a nice police department. I appreciate it. Really nice. Yeah. Small, but nice. Yeah. Ain't big Austin, huh? No, it ain't, it ain't as big as Bad Austin. Bad Austin's real big. So are you from Bad Austin? Yeah. Born and raised? Born and raised. Man. How you doing? Couple of hair now, Sheriff's Office. How you doing? Just videoing. Oh, just video? Okay. Yes, sir. That's fine. That's fine. You don't do, if you do us a favor, get out the road in case the car goes by. Yes, Maybe sir. Not in the road. Yes, sir. All right. Have fun. You have a nice day. But uh, anyway, the last cops, I guess they try to like they was gonna intimidate me in some kind of way. The last one, a black guy, but I can. Get this jackass getting out of this car. They can call me what they want. They need to get new cars. My tax dollars pays for that. How are you? Am I right? Shame. How you doing? How you doing? Pretty good. Relaxing. That's it. Yep. You be good now. Be good, officer. All right, take it easy, man. You too. Where well, I know you from? You don't know me. You, you cook down? No, sir. Oh, you at? No. Too small. Huh? Too small. Brook County too small? Yeah. Ain't nothing here. I mean, look what you drive. I know, right? Yeah, ain't nothing here. Ain't no money here. No, it ain't. Not a thing. You have a nice day, sir. Alright, take it easy, bro. So, that's where the video ends. Not bad for his first audit, and I will say, Jeremy did a good job here at the end. He didn't let Officer Moore know anything else, and when they started to question him, he didn't answer him. I think the biggest problem in this video was on the part of the police. While Jeremy did everything mostly right, the police failed to educate those inside the building. Officer Moore admitted that someone inside called about a suspicious person recording. Now, they made contact and did what they had to, but they never went inside. Instead, they just drove off and went back to collecting money from the taxpayers. Jeremy could have went inside and tried to educate those people, but just like you saw, there's a lock, and unless you have access to get in. Pretty weird considering that the building is public property. All in all, big props to Jeremy for recording here. Now, this video is a bit old, and I'm not sure if Jeremy is still out here doing this, but hopefully we can motivate him to come back. Make sure you all head on over to Jeremy Thomas's channel, subscribe, and let's go leave a comment. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for watching.